Wednesday, March the 19th, Cork Opera House, uh, the main stage, the main arena. Uh, Max T. Barnes is, is, is doing a show there. Max uh, T. Barnes and Craig Curtis. And uh, I'm opening the show for Max. I, I was sitting at home when the phone rang and, and a woman called Beverly Stafford rang me uh, on behalf of Max T. Barnes and they were putting the tour together because he was coming over. So uh, she said, um, would you play uh, at the opening slot? And I said, yeah. And I asked her, I said, where did you come across me? And seemingly a couple of years ago, Max was touring Ireland again and he was in one of the local radio stations and the DJ on the programme he was being interviewed uh, played, I think it was Lifetime Guarantee, off the last album I had. And Max T. Bands liked it and, and they spoke about it for a few minutes and when Max T. discovered I wrote the song, he said, yeah, that, that, that's pretty good. So when it came to putting this tour together, they were getting songwriters from, from the local areas to play with Max T. and different things like that. So... My name came up again, and, and I think he remembered, you know, the fact that he'd heard the song before. So he'd said to Beverly, you know, get in touch with Shane. It's easy free. I've written a lot of songs that have been recorded by different people down through the years. Um, I suppose the Highway song springs to mind because that's uh, used. That was the last time I came across that. That was used in uh, some Taiwanese Asian TV program like Top Gear and they were using the Highway song as, as backing music to that and the only reason I know that is uh, when I got the Imro statement at the end of the year it was on it and what it was used for the Rubber Bandits have also used the Highway song as well in some of the live stage shows I'm afraid to ask what they're using it for or whereabouts they're using it but they use it um, I suppose Dance the Last Dance another song was recorded by, by Dad Art Soppel on one of his albums and um, Kevin Prendergast uh, recorded a song called Here Am I Where Are You on his album Cottage by the Sea and of course Mick Flavin recorded Lifetime Guarantee which was on the Irish Country Music Album of the Year I think it was 2012-2013 I'm not too sure you know so that was on his album and when they re-released it his compilation album it was on that um, local bands then have recorded like Freedom and, and, and different songs so I've always been writing and I've always been recording to date I think I've about five albums done myself and on each of those albums I would always have a couple of original songs she said of all the times you tried her all the times that you will fail don't let this setback stop you my boy you must prevail for a love just like they had Max T. Barnes has played guitar with like Reba McIntyre, George Jones, uh, the Judds, uh, Gareth Brooks, to name but a few he's played guitar with. And as I said, he's written songs for Colin Ray, Love Me, he wrote that song. He's written songs for Randy Travis, George Jones. He's had nine number ones in America, sold 20 million albums worldwide, and he's appearing in the Opera House. And he asked me to stand up on stage in front of him with an acoustic guitar and sing a few songs. But I figured if I was going to be playing with such a, a legend on stage, I'd bring our own legend along. So on the night I have a local guitar player, songwriter, musician and singer, that's Padraig Parker. So Padraig is going to be joining me on stage to play a bit of guitar behind me. So it, it, it'll help, you know. It depends on where I am and who I'm with, but, but, but on this particular occasion it'll be just me and Padraig Parker. I'm releasing a new album called Blue Skies Ahead. Uh, that'll be available on that night onwards. And it's just a matter of, you know, keep the head down and keep writing and I've been asked by a few of the Irish country singers to write a few songs for them so that's an ongoing thing so where where, where I see myself in, in, in a year's time or five years time who knows you know I'll just keep going with the flow keep writing keep singing and uh, just keep the fingers crossed really at the end of the day who knows where it'll take you you know I mean you could end up anywhere and I've been lucky in that I've I've seen parts of the world that I would never have seen only for music Six months after the Berlin Wall came down, I remember playing in Russia, you know, to, to people who couldn't speak English and didn't even understand what we were doing. But once the music started, they were quite happy. And I've gotten to meet some of my heroes in the sporting world by playing at different functions down through the years. And, and I've been lucky that I've played with some great bands down through the years as well. And I mean, I've, I've worked with Paddy O'Brien in the country and music scene. I've worked with Brendan Shine. And of course, I've worked with Dad. And I've stood in with lots of other bands. And I'm constantly kind of working in studios producing albums I've done I've produced about 45 uh, 46 albums to date working with local bands working with local singers and it's 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 great fun and long may it last and we'll keep going as long as we can I have a granddaughter and uh, she's three years of age and like she, she knows me as, as as granddad and she has another grandfather as well grandfather Paddy but uh, somewhere along the line uh, she saw 
an advert that was being done for me on, on one of the television shows and at the end of the advert it comes up you know www dot com. so when anyone asks her what's your granddad's name she automatically replies granddad's name is www.shanesupple.com <laughs> so you know that's the address you'll find me there you'll find me on Facebook you'll find me on Twitter you'll find me on Google Plus LinkedIn you'll find me on, on, on the web www.shanesupple.com 